So Respawn have finally tweeted out something about the global launch of Apex Legends Mobile, boys. The tweet says right here, Legends changed the game, but they can't do that without you. In this tweet, all nine Legends are included, so it looks like we're going to get all nine Legends in the global launch of Apex. And then right at the end of the tweet, it says that something legendary arrives this month. And we all know what that means, boys. On top of the global launch, I'm going to be giving away the Red Magic 7 phone. And all you have to do is go ahead and follow me on Provo and come and watch the daily live streams. Now, in this video, I want to give you everything you need to know to prepare for the global launch of Apex Mobile. But before we do, let's just take a minute to appreciate Loba. <laughs> yeah, boy. Okay, so the game is currently in soft launch. A lot of you guys have been asking me, you know, what happens to our accounts? Does everything get wiped? Blah, blah, blah. I've mentioned this before. Everything on our accounts gets absolutely wiped from the game. That includes skins, battle passes, everything we've purchased. Now, take me, for example. I'm in the UK and I'm connecting to Mexico under a Mexican VPN. I play on iOS and Android. Now, I log in on Facebook using my Facebook ID. So all I have to do is use that exact same account when the global launch comes out but again a lot of us are wondering what happens is there a break in between soft launch and global or are we going to go straight into it personally i think we're going to have maybe like a week break in between now our skins boys a lot of you guys have been crying like yo bro my skins what's gonna happen bro all that money wasted on a soft launch boys Man up. Respawn have already said that every single skin and everything you've purchased in the game will be converted back into gold syndicate coins. Meaning that when global comes, yes, your Apex character will be butt naked. But you'll have a load of gold syndicate coins and 25% extra to spend on all of the new skins that's going to be in global launch. Now, the in-game store closes on May the 7th, so it could indicate, you know, with that tweet, they've said that it arrives later this month. Probably going to be in the second half of this month, anything after the 15th. So, personally i think maybe we'll get the servers closed down around the 15th maybe for a week and then the global launch will come out probably towards the end of the month real quick guys what if i told you that you can play your favorite games of all time on any mobile phone with just one app the same way you do when you listen to music or you know watch movies cloud gaming is a new way to play video games in the cloud and via streaming without the need to spend money on a console or having an expensive computer you can even play any video game on your old calculator if you wanted to i want to introduce you guys to nware nware are on a mission to bring you the freedom and the platform to play video games anytime anywhere without the need to purchase any expensive hardware no matter where you live they want to give you the possibility of playing video games instantly without any limitations and all of it is possible thanks to cloud gaming and streaming technology now there's a special feature in nware called launchers where users can access steam epic games and ubisoft launchers to freely install any of their own games in their very own virtual machine you'll be able to stream and play your games in real time you only need a supported device and an internet connection now nware is currently in beta but it's going to be available for windows 7 or up or Android 8 or up. The mission as a platform is to give users the freedom to play video games wherever and whenever they want without any limits. Right now, there's a sign up for the waiting list on the website where you can receive a free invitation code and you can try all of this out for three days. So if you don't want to pay for it up front, you can get this free trial and try it out. And guys, I've already tried it. It's insane. Again, the mission of the platform and the team behind it is to give users the freedom to play video games wherever and whenever they want without, again, any limitations at all. So you can be on the bus, you you can be sitting in bed, you can be lying on the couch, you can be on your roof anywhere you want and you'll be able to play any game you like straight from your mobile device if you guys want to sign up i've put a link in the description if you want to go check it out yourself make sure you go and do it and thank you nware for sponsoring this video now you guys are also wondering what servers are going to be available in the game now if you check this video out just here it shows that someone just got an, a message in game that shows that you've reached ranked diamond 2 with however much rp on server mina so we're going to have a mina server which is the middle east now are we going to get eu na are we going to get yeah, SEA. Most likely, yes, but we'll have to wait and see. That's unconfirmed, but at least you know that server Mina is going to be available for all of you Middle Eastern players. Now, there was a leak in the game a couple of days ago that showed that Season 1 is going to be the first season that we're going to be starting on in Apex Legends Mobile. Now, seasons on PC usually last 90 days, which is three months, and then obviously the ranked, we usually split 45 days each. 
So to go over everything, it looks like we're going to have nine legends in season one. And we're going to have two maps available. The maps that are going to be playable are King's Canyon and World's Edge. But we're also going to have a lot of snippets from the other maps like Olympus and stuff in the multiplayer modes. Like Arenas and TDM. Now I could go on for ages just how buzzed I am over this, guys. I know a lot of you guys are excited as well. I've been making content for two years and finally we've actually got something. On top of that, we've actually got an official community manager called It's Arcta. Who has actually joined the Play Apex mode our team who is going to be the dedicated community manager for the game as well so we're going to have non-stop responses on twitter and we're going to have a lot more hype for the game now the only other things we know is that there's going to be some mobile exclusive legends so legends that aren't available on the pc and console version and there's also going to be some mobile exclusive multiplayer modes as well so could we be seeing some other mobile game modes search and destroy what imagine now one last little juicy thing i'm going to show you guys just before you know we're almost at global i'm going to show you a juicy little leak that i see right here check this video out someone found that there's going to be a predator trail in the game i mean if this is legit guys then we're going to have the predator rank in apex mobile now on pc and console there's only 750 players that can make it into predator rank so if you manage to get one of them on mobile then you're a beast and that's everything i can show you guys today get freaking excited man because we're going to be able to play this game on low ping in your own region you're gonna be able to save all of your progress i'm fully ready to give you as much content as i can boys and girls just like i've been doing for the past two years as well i was one of the most og content creators making content on this game if not the first and i just can't believe it's been two years and it's finally here it's kind of scary but kind of exciting so i can't wait for you guys to follow me on this journey remember go follow me on trovo as well all you have to do is follow me there watch the live streams make sure you subscribe and follow my twitter as well and you might win one of these bad boys. Now that's everything today, guys. Thank you so much for watching. And soon, it'll be here. Peace!